Now, CBS4 Weather with Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer. Now the big question, will the weather cooperate? And I've got good news and bad news. More on that in a bit. Here's our Windjammer Resort camera this afternoon. It's been a pretty cloudy day. A little light rain across the area. That, uh, I didn't expect it to come in quite as early as it did, but uh, the evening's not that bad right now. Just a few waves breaking along the beaches there uh, in Lauderdale by the sea. 75 in Miami, 73 Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood, 76 in Key West. Sticking the scales of two. Humidities are not too bad. The wind is calm right now and really no official rainfall amounts at MIA. Not enough to tip the rain gauge bucket there. In terms of the radar, still a little bit of light rain going through the Keys right now. Some uh, in south sections of Miami-Dade, but all in all, not too bad. Temperatures in the low to mid 70s is going to be a comfortable evening. Temperatures not going to be too cool or as cool as they were last night tonight. Winds basically light westerly right now. Satellite loop through the day today. You can see lots and lots of clouds streaming across the state. And the bigger picture showing that area of moisture that's located now to our west, but it's slowly sinking to the south, so that's good news. In terms of that moisture, it kind of continues to move on out as we go into your Tuesday. <clears throat> so Tuesday looking pretty good. Mostly dry conditions over north and central Florida. Wednesday, a little bit of moisture around, mix of sun and clouds, maybe a shower. Thursday, some drier air comes in. It was like, wow, smooth sailing into the weekend, right? Mm -mm. Big area of moisture comes up out of the the southern Gulf of Mexico. So Friday, our chances for rain increase throughout the day. That lasts through Friday night and Saturday. So parties on Friday night and Saturday could have some issues. The good news is though this all gets swept up by Sunday. Super dry air moves in. It's looking like a super nice day for Super Bowl Sunday here in South Florida. In terms of temperatures across the country, they are mild. Nobody is really extremely cool at all. It is uh, late January now, but it's a big January thaw going on over much of the nation and the weather systems not too big across the nation. Fast moving jet stream is kind of keeping all the cold air bottled up to the north for the time being. For us tonight, just a few showers, comfortably cool, lows in the low 60s. Tomorrow, look for a mix of sun and clouds, a stray shower still possible. High temperature near 78 degrees. For boaters, winds really not a problem on the water, uh, averaging pretty light in wind speed and taking us through the rest of the week. Well, your Tuesday, a spotty shower. Wednesday, not too bad. Thursday, looking nice. Friday, showers move in. Saturday, it could be wet, but Sunday, looking fantastic. Back to you.